One of my favorite things to do is to go online and look at different images to create different projects. I went online and I put in sewing machines, which I love sewing machines. So I came up with this image that came up on my computer. I printed it out in my printer and I created this tote bag. And this is one of my favorites. And I did it with black vinyl. Then I just created a t-shirt with it. And you can see I put some bling on it. I like to do embellishments with Savorsky crystals. Now let's see exactly how it was that I created this. I want to scan a design. I took that sewing machine out of the um, computer and I downloaded it, printed it out, and I scanned it on the scanning mat. I'm gonna go into my retrieve data and I'm gonna hit the USB stick. That's gonna allow me to look for it. Whenever you scan something, what you need to do is scan it first, then you have to download it to a USB stick, which I did. Now I'm going to grab it. And what I did was I enlarged it because I want this to go on my tote bag. And you can see, now I have to hit okay. edit, object edit, and I'm gonna mirror image it because I need it to be backwards. Hit okay, hit okay again, okay again, please select, and I'm gonna select cut. So remember, when you're scanning anything from a file, you want to scan it, save it to your USB stick, and then pull it up in your USB stick in order to get it and size it, because I did size it. This has been in my machine, in my USB stick, because I did this sewing machine um, a couple months ago. So I had already sized it and saved it. So that's the other thing you can do. You save it once you've sized it, and then you're ready to go. And there's the sewing machine. And then you hit start and it will cut for you.